Hey guys, welcome back. Andrew here with Ambient Endeavors. And in today's video, we are going to do a little compare and contrast. We're going to revisit this Enya Nova Go Sonic, a really cool carbon fiber electric guitar with some fun bells and whistles. We're going to kind of stack it up against a more traditional electric guitar and just sort of talk about some of the uh, comparatives, some of the unique qualities of this Enya Nova Go Sonic and put them kind of side by side as best as we can. I want to preface this by saying that it really truly is a pretty apples and oranges comparison. The Nova Go Sonic has some unique qualities that you just don't really find in a lot of other electric guitars. And I also don't have a very directly comparable guitar uh, to put up against it here in the studio. So we're going to do the best we can. We're going to just sort of talk uh, about some of the observations and some of the features and points of comparison and contrast between uh, the two and let you guys kind of get a feel for what you can expect from the Nova Go Sonic. If you're interested in some more kind of foundational or elementary information about the Nova Go Sonic, I have a couple of other videos that talk about who this guitar as four and that kind of showcase this guitar uh, and its sights and sounds more specifically. So check out those in the description below uh, or continue watching this if you're curious about how it kind of stacks up with a traditional electric guitar. We will be using this Reverend Double Agent OG as our comparison. I'll note this guitar is around $1,000 new, so it's over two times the price of the Nova Go Sonic. It's similarly equipped with pickups, although it has a P90 in the neck, a humbucker in the bridge. It's about the closest sort of Sonic comparison to the Nova Go Sonic that I have in the studio here, and so that's why I'm using it, but again, apples and oranges here and we're not going to lean too heavily on a direct sound comparison between the two because they're just kind of different instruments. One initial point of contrast as I put that other guitar down is just the weight of the two guitars. So the carbon fiber construction, also the slightly smaller size of the Nova Go Sonic lends it to be a pretty lightweight instrument. Um, probably in the six or so pound range where the Reverend I just put down is probably pushing eight and a half pounds, maybe even nine pounds, a pretty substantial, pretty heavy electric guitar. And depending on what guitars you're looking at and which you would be comparing to the Nova Go Sonic, you would feel a significant difference in the weight and the feel, even the size of the guitar here. Another advantage of the Novigo Sonic in terms of feel is the neck. There's an interesting kind of asymmetrical design and contour to the neck as you go up and down the neck. It's really, really comfortable. It's a really comfortable playing guitar. You also have this unique uh, carve back here that allows you to get access to these upper frets really, really easily. Very few guitars and a certainly budget guitars have that type of contour, that type of accessibility to the upper frets and even this type of comfortable neck. And so I think that's something that uh, the Nova Go Sonic really does kind of excel in. As I run my hand up and down the neck too, the fret ends are nowhere near touching my fingers. They're really well dressed. They're really well rounded and smoothed. And that's kind of a common complaint of lower end guitars. Even some of the guitars that get up into that reverend uh, guitar category will find some sprouting of the frets on the edge that can be sharp and uncomfortable for sliding up and down. So Enya really did a great job in the design or the QC of these guitars in terms of frets. <laughs> If you heard the video that showcased this guitar in a traditional electric guitar setup without the onboard effects, you'll know that the pickups really are a pretty similar uh, sound and vibe to a humbucker that you would have in a comparable electric guitar. So those compare really pretty favorably to uh, any other humbucker you'd find in, uh, in a guitar this sort of range. And so I think uh, I wouldn't give an advantage or a disadvantage to that in this Enya guitar, but just to say 
say that you are getting something that's very familiar in sound and feel uh, and you also have the ability to um, get a single coil type sound when pulling out the volume pot on this guitar so you can kind of have some versatility there along with a really traditional uh, really pretty solid sounding humbucker tone what you get with the carbon fiber construction and aesthetic as well is a little bit more durable of a guitar. If you think about a painted wood electric guitar, they're just a little more susceptible to those nicks and dings that can kind of impact the visual aesthetic of the guitar as it wears. Um, I imagine this carbon fiber material will be pretty resistant to any sort of dings or nicks. Uh, you probably have to do something pretty significant to kind of impact that. And then of course the obvious inclusion, the obvious feature here in the Novago Sonic is this built-in speaker along with an app-based bank of effects and sounds that you can integrate into this guitar. It's something that has definitely been covered in, in my videos and other videos on this guitar, so I won't go into that, but that is kind of a huge differentiator in terms of how it compares to a traditional guitar. I think that, as I mentioned in other videos, this gives it a strength, especially to beginning players, to those that are kind of picking up and learning the instrument and want to kind of dive into some different sounds or more of a variety of sounds right on board your instrument. You can pretty easily dial up some interesting modulation sounds, add some reverb or delay and things like that that can make your playing and learning experience more fun. And so that's one of the big calling cards of Enya and specifically this Nova Go Sonic. Those are just a few uh, points of comparison and contrast the Enya Nova Go Sonic and a more traditional electric guitar. Hopefully this helps you as you kind of continue to uh, find the instrument that works for you as you consider where you're at as a player and what sort of tools you want or need to reach your goals. And thank you to Enya again for sending this guitar out. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time.